Yes, guys, welcome to Tango TV. This is me, myself, and I alone weighing 5,000 pounds. Tango, yes, guys, um, just have finished having lunch, the dining, and um, some guys have been asking me to show them ar around the Mishang dormitory. So, right now, I want to do that. So guys, sit back, relax, as I will, you know, show you everything you need to see. The dome is not far, I'm already here at the dome. In a um, few seconds, I will be there. Yes, so, yes, this is the International Student Dormitory. You can see Dormitory number 12. It's written there, dormitory number 12 for international students. Uh, let me go backward to show you what it looks like. See, from the front. Yes, guys. So this is what you are going to see when you come. Yes, guys. This is the dome from another angle. Yeah. So, now let's get into the dormitory. Yes, and um, the only way to get into the dormitory is is if you have a card I mean, this is my student card without this card you can't get in so if you come here without the card you have to wait for someone because you have to swipe you know like this yes so i'm in the dome now once you get into the dome you can notice the flags of different um countries you know clearly showing that this is an international student apartment you know this is um this was meant to welcome new students but you know because of the closure of border you know guys couldn't make it here but you know you're always welcome and you can see the counter yeah and there is the beautiful emmy hello emmy <laughs> yeah emmy is here to solve any problem you have when you arrive yeah she's very helpful you know, one thing I love about the dome is this vending machine, man. This is a lifesaver. You know, sometimes you wake up in the night and um, you need something, you know, to support your biscuits or your snacks. You just come down here and um, get it's very cheap. See, you can see for like 4 yuan, 3 yuan. Oh, that's like less than a, I don't know how much in dollar. So... And you know, this is just uh, me making sure you stay alert, you know. And um, yes, you can see some student just walked in, guys. Let me show you another part of the building. Yeah, so this is the laundry room, you know, this is where we'll do our washing. You know, you can see the washing machines one, two, three. Then dryer, you can see, let me show you around. Uh, you can also wash your shoes, you know, the shoe wash is here. So, if you want to use this machine, you have to download the app. When you come, you'll be, you know, you'll be given the, the link to download the app. You just have to scan here. Yes, after scanning, you'll pay, uh, I think, 5 yuan, depending on you. Um, how long you want your clothes to wash, but I think the maximum is 45 minutes to use this So it's very convenient. It's very um, helpful So this is the um, Laundry room guys. Let's move to the next part Yes guys, so let's get into the dome properly. You know when you come here you're going to this is the first floor um, I think I want to show you a room what it looks like so uh, let me see where do i go fifth floor let me take you to the fifth floor so this is the ele elevator um you know if you, if you, there's an ele elevator to take you to any floor this is a 12 floor building you know there are 12 floors so and there's also you know let me show you the staircase here so you have different options if you if you don't want to use the elevator, you can use the staircase. I think it's almost here now. Yes. 
yeah guys let me step in so right now i'm going to the fifth floor to show you the room you can see the elevator is very very clean very neat yeah. talking about no drugs here yeah. don't do drugs no smoking no smoking is not allowed here you know okay we are here now yes guys so when you step out of the elevator yes just like you saw on the first floor it's the same thing the whole thing is just symmetric you know we are going to see the doors and then the room number so don't worry the room numbers are boldly written on the door yeah guys yes guys so right now i want to show you a room this is an empty room it was used by my very good friend he's graduated now so the room is empty and I uh, asked permission and I've been given the keys, you know. So I'm going to show you what you are going to see when you come because you'll be given an empty room. Yes, guys. So let me start from the bathroom. You can see from here you can see let me open the door. Okay. okay. This is the mirror. First, you're going to see the mirror. I'm not supposed to appear there, sorry. <laughs> okay. This is for the bathroom. This is where you shower. You can see. Yeah. Shower here, and then this is the toilet. Mm -hmm. Toilet. This is the sink to brush. No? Uh -huh. To brush. Then you also have a, a switch maybe for charging your maybe if you want to if you shave if you want to shave okay and then here you switch for the light you know for the light if I turn this on everywhere it goes dark okay yeah and then this is for the fan you know and this is for the you know if I put my card here it's for shower you know I can slot it here for hot water yeah, see, I have 3.77 UN in my card. So if you also want to know how much you have in your card, you can use, you know, just like I slotted, and this is my balance, you know, and you can use this for hot water or uh, uh, if you want to shower. And then up there, you're going to see fan and then the AC. Okay, let me go back a little. So here you have a um, cabinet, so you can... Um, you know put whatever you want to put here maybe your shoes or anything depending on you and then most the rooms here are mostly double especially for undergraduate and master students you are going to be living two two so everything here is meant to be shared you know like for example the cupboard here let me show you the cupboard yeah let me open it see one side is for one person, the other side is for another person. So only PhD students live alone. So you see there are two beds. Uh, this is bed bed two, as you can see, and bed one. Then on top of it, you have your different uh, cabinets there. Okay. No. And uh, cupboards. Okay, here you also have another. So you can keep your laptop or your computer or whatever here. Yes, and then you also have some small stool to sit. You can see. Yeah, so let me take you now to the balcony. Yeah, there's a curtain I have to open. Kind of sunny out there. I hope you get the best yes guys so when you come here oh you can see the campus looks so beautiful you can see right from here you can have a view of the campus you know people going people going to class or going about very beautiful view of the school you know yeah so this is the balcony you know you can wash and dry your clothes here and you can also sit down here you know and just 
have a view or just just this so, so light you know light there you can dry your clothes when you wash and you know, very wonderful place yes guys so let me take you to another part of the dome yes guys so guys i just use the stairs to come down to the third floor where i will be showing you the kitchen i'm coming here because the kitchen here has been completed you know and it's very beautiful i want to show you because by the time you arrive hopefully when the borders are open the other kitchens will be done mostly so this is the third floor kitchen and um, you can see it's very beautiful you can sit here to eat chill you know this is home <laughs> yeah and we'll go back a little to show you everything mm -hmm. you can see this different cupboard here for you to this hot plates and um, the microwave or oh, somebody left bread there yeah, and there's a fridge you know I don't want to open this because people stuff are in there you know this is not I don't stay here so it's very beautiful yeah so I will still show you that uh, the other ones the other kitchens for the other floors but you know I just want to show you this one it's really nice and um, we hope that um, by the time the borders are open and you guys arrive, the other kitchens will be looking like this by the time you arrive. Okay guys, so this is the kitchen. Yes guys, yes guys. So this is the seventh floor kitchen. Now I told you guys I was going to show you the kitchen for other floors. Yes. So this is what it looks like but we are hoping that like i told you guys earlier i hope that very soon um the renovation will also reach here you know by the time you guys are back so i would like to show you guys my room you know i'm lucky that my room is beside the kitchen so i don't have to go far so aha let's go in this is how i have been able to convert my room you know i showed you guys an empty room that time so this is how I have been able to convert my room. I live alone because my roommates never came. So this is where Tango TV lives. <laughs> yeah, that's my mom's portrait, my portrait. Yeah. So guys, um, this has been the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it and um, you love what you saw. Uh, but mention is a very beautiful campus, you know. So please don't forget to subscribe if you are new on the channel and um, share the video and um, thank you for your support guys and uh, I hope to see you guys soon in Meishang. Thank you very much and enjoy your time. See you next time. Bye bye.